Hi friend, my name is Puspendra Sani. Once again, I came with a very interesting tutorial. In this tutorial, I will tell you how you can design a country picker in your uh, iPhone application. Let's say you are working on any application and you require some country picker like that. So this is my country picker and here you will get all the images of the country and uh, name of the country and with extension code of the country without doing any third party library so we will do do that in a very quick way okay so let's begin with development and enjoy the coding flow so guys this is my screen here i have created this button okay and i take the outlet inside my mobile view controller okay actually this is the topic of previous uh, video tutorial so if you did not watch my previous video in previous videos i have covered this mobile screen and otp screen so if you did not watch these video then you can find into the description okay so let's begin with it first of all we have to take one view controller inside that for a country picker so let's say view controller this is my view controller which we will use for a country picker okay here what i'm going to do i'll set the background color of this view controller as we defined and it is a red and inside that we are going to take one search view so it's search bar so this is search bar i am going to add in my view controller and here i will set the constraint of this search bar and i will set from top 0 right 0 0 and i will set the height as 50 uh, sorry 50 constant okay now finally i will take one table view for showing the list table view so this is my table view here i will take that and i will set the constraint to this one from all the side 0 0 0 so this is my table view okay now i will create one controller for that and that will be view controller so new file coca touch class click on next and this will be your view controller select from here and say as country click on next create so this is my view controller okay inside that now open your main storyboard select your view controller for a country and assign the class country controller same for id now open your country uh, country controller and assign the layouts controller and here is my country controller so from here we will assign the layouts first layout is my search bar so this is search bar or we can say search yeah search bar and second one is table view okay table view so fine so that's fine okay now i'll open my mobile view controller and from mobile view controller i will open my country picker okay so i'll copy this code and i'll take one button uh, which is here button country okay on the click of button country i have to open my uh, country picker okay so add target self selector here we will pass selector sorry it's selector and tap for country dot touch up inside so that's fine now i'll create one function objc function at the very bottom i'll create at objc func and the name of the function will be same tap country okay so this will be your function copy and paste here yeah so from here i'll open my country controller country so this is my country controller and copy paste here now i will see the output click on login click on country here you can see our country controller is coming okay now i will set all the country list here and 
we will integrate the search functionality over here okay yeah so now i'll open my country controller here first of all i'll set the title select country okay so self dot navigation item dot title and here will be title as select country okay so finally at the end i'll create one function which will uh, before creating one function i need to create one model so for model i'll create one folder new groups models and here i'll create the a swift file and the name of the file is uh, country okay here we will hold all the details of the country like class country and this is like that here we will hold all the details of the country like so this will be the detail country code name of the country currency code of the country currency symbol of the country extension code like Plus nine one, plus nine three, or plus one, or plus two four one, like that. And this will be flag for the country. Okay. So this is my class. Now open your country controller. Inside that, create one function for configuration. And this function we will hold all the list. Here I will take where list, and this will be type of country okay by initial i am taking that as a blank so this is my list okay i'll call this function from view did load configure okay configuration so here we are going to find all the countries uh, from the ios dictionary okay so here is the code for the country so this is the ns local okay of the library of a uh, apple here we will find the list of all countries okay iso list of all countries so first of all we will find the name of the country okay so let name equals ns locale here i'll pass my identifier and here i'll give the language name english dash us okay and now here i'll call display and for which key the key will be ns locale dot key dot what will be the key identity identifier okay here we have to pass the id okay so this is id now this will be the complete output okay here i'll check if name is not equals nil then i'll set the name okay same way i'm doing this at the bottom now this is the name so rest of the information we will find with the help of any object okay so uh, local object okay so let, let local equals ns local dot init with identifier will be id so this will be my local now i'll find the first of all first thing is country code so let country code equals to local dot object here we have to pass the key okay and key will be same as usual ns local dot key dot country code okay so this will be the country code country code same way we have to find the currency code currency symbol okay so open your country model i'll copy and paste for currency currency symbol and this is for flag so i'll copy this same this is currency code okay for currency code i am doing the coding country code after currency code now currency symbol so this will be currency symbol now 
extension code and flag for extension code and flag we have to do some coding some additional coding okay so from here we will remove this now i'll create one extension here extension and type will be stream okay so here i'll create one function so here this will be the function for uh, converting your hash code into the currency okay so here you can see is first of all we are converting the string into the lower case okay then we are finding the scaling and we are finding the symbols okay unicode scalar will provide the symbols and that's we are returning from here okay so this will return us the uh, country flag now we have to create one extension for uh, mobile number extension okay so this will be the extension for uh, mobile number code and here all the countries code will be available so i'll uh, post this code into the my tutorial you can find it out there now what we have to do if name is not equals to nil we have to create object so let model equals to type of country and here model dot name equals to name model dot country code equals country code model dot currency code equals currency code so will be type of a string okay fine model dot currency symbol this will be currency symbol as string the optional now model dot flag equals string dot flag and for string here we have to pass the code okay code now model dot the last thing is extension okay extension code equals we have to again ns locale here dot extension code and here we have to pass our country code so a country code is model dot country code okay so this will be the complete model now i'll make it optional and here also i'll take optional fine default i'm taking in okay so here what i'm going to do i will add all the models into the list dot append dot model so this is my complete list now what i'm going to do and from here we are not using this one currency code this will be currency part so now i will reload my table self dot table view dot reload data and here i'll set self dot uh, table view dot separate style equals to dot none okay now finally what i'm going to do i'll create extension for my table so extension and uh, the name of the controller is country controller ui table view delegate comma ui table view data source so these two things we require now we will extend the function of this one so here two function is here now number of row into the section return list dot 
count okay now cell let cell equals table view dot dq with identifier cell okay and this i'll create here copy open your main storyboard select your controller okay and here click on inspector give the prototype cell 1 click on your cell and here give the reuse identifier as cell now come back to your country, uh, country controller now here we will return this cell okay return cell now cell dot text label dot text equals here what we are going to set list of index path dot row and dot flag space list of index path dot row dot name so here we are going to pass this one and fix it fix it default value nothing here default value we can say nothing so just leave as it is okay flag is required and name is required so now we will see the output it should be as expected click on login click on country nothing is coming because here we forgot to set the delegate okay self dot table view dot delegate equals self self dot table view dot data source equals self so now i think it should work as expected click on login country so here all the countries is coming with icons okay in next video i am going to implement the search functionality with the search bar okay here we will find the country with the name so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you like this video if you like this video so guys do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel because on my youtube channel you will find lots of videos related to swift development and it's really helpful for boosting your skills okay so thank you so much have a great time happy coding bye bye